When God delivered Moses and the Israelites from the Egyptians, God said he would lead them to a promised land. God sent a cloud to lead them in the daytime. And he sent a pillar of fire to lead them in the nighttime. After a while, the Israelites came to the edge of the Red Sea. God told Moses to set up camp there. But while they were camping there, they heard the Egyptians coming. Pharaoh changed his mind. He was chasing the Israelites so they wouldn't get away and he was bringing all of his horses and chariots with him and all of his armies. When the Egyptians got closer to the Israelites, the Israelites were afraid because they were trapped. They cried out to Moses and to God and said, Why did you bring us out here if we're just going to die in the wilderness? But Moses said unto the people, Fear ye not, stand still, and see the salvation of the Lord, which he will show to you today. God told Moses to lift up his staff, and to stretch his hand out over the Red Sea, and to divide the waters so that the Israelites could cross the sea on dry ground. A strong wind came and blew the waters back and it divided the sea. The Israelites walked through the sea on dry ground, and the waters were like a big wall next to them on both sides. The Egyptians kept chasing the Israelites, and they also went into the sea on the dry ground. Then God made the water go back, and it covered up the Pharaoh and all of Pharaoh's armies. The Israelites were safe. The Israelites saw the great things that the Lord did for them, and they believed in him, and they believed his servant Moses. And Moses said unto the people, Fear ye not, stand still, and see the salvation of the Lord, which he will show to you today. Did you know we create lesson plans and activity pages to go with our videos every week? They're made by a professional teacher just for kids. Tell your teacher. Tell your mom. They're on our website. LatterdayKids.com